find the LCM of 64 and 98. To find the LCM, for that we should frame it in this way. 64, 98. This is your step 1. Now you should focus on to the first number which is 64 here. In this number last digit 4 e1 so take 2. First number 6 when do we get 6 in 2 table 2 3 6. The other number 4 when do we get 4 in 2 table 2 2 is 4. Now the other number 98 last digit 8 e1 so this is divisible by 2. First number 9, a number close to 9 in 2 table is 2 4 8. 9 minus 8 1, 1 carried forward 18, when do we get 18 in 2 table, 2 9 18. Now 32, last digit 2, e1, so take 2. First number 3, a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2 1 2. 3 minus 2, 1, 1 carried forward 12, when do we get 12 in 2 table, 2 6 12. Now the other number 49. Last digit 9 not E1 so this is not divisible by 2. So you write it down as it is. Now 16 is 2 8 16. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now 8 is 2 4 8. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now 4 is 2 2 is 4. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now we have 2, 2 is a prime number so 2 1 is 2. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now we got 1 here. So focus on to the other number 49. 49 is 7, 7 is 49. Now we have 7, 7 is a prime number, so 7 once 7. So we got 1 in both the places. So our LCM is, LCM is the product of these numbers. That is 2 into 2 into 2, 2 into 2 into 2 and into 7 into 7. When we multiply these numbers, we get 3136 is our LCM.